If you're new to cybersecurity, or for some reason you've read the patch notes for any browser before, you've probably heard of the term cross-site scripting, or XSS. Cross-site scripting is a web vulnerability that allows someone to inject JavaScript code into a web application that will run on other users' browsers when they visit a vulnerable website. This injected JavaScript code, called the payload, can be written to do many things for the attacker, including stealing your session cookie to be able to log in as you, spread malware, deface a website to make it look like it was taken over, or even replace the web page with a fake login page to fish for credentials. Cross-site scripting is currently third in the OWASP top 10 web vulnerabilities under injection, and although it cannot directly lead to remote code execution, it is still a dangerous and common vulnerability that can lead to account takeovers and the installation of malware. If a website that utilizes JavaScript allows us to input text somewhere on the application, and that text is displayed somewhere on the page, if this input is not properly sanitized, then we may be able to write our own JavaScript onto the web application and have it executed. For example, if we have a form that allows us to post comments, if we input some JavaScript code that makes a pop-up on the page and submit it as a comment, then the web page may execute that JavaScript code, and every time someone looks at your comment, they will get that pop-up. 